Welcome back to another video, guys. It's JG Fish keeping here, and sorry I haven't been uploading. It's just um with this online school and everything, but I'm gonna be keeping up on the grind now. Uh, we're not stopping. Uh, videos every two days, and if you guys don't know, I have been streaming on Twitch for about five days. And if you guys want to check me out on Twitch, my my Twitch name is Twitch.tv slash it's aqua 713 so go check me out i'll be playing games a bunch of cool stuff and um yeah so i really appreciate it and today's video so let's get let's head straight into today's video today's video is going to be about the um filling up my pond this pond has uh i need i filled up maybe last month it needs to be have need a refill so we're going to be filling up the pond today um really easy stuff i'm going to show you exactly uh if you have like a pool pond like this I'm going to be showing you how to um, basically like fill up a pool pond and everything else. So, hope you guys enjoy this video. Hope this video is informational for you guys. And hopefully you guys understand about all this. And hopefully you guys are staying safe with this virus and everything. So yeah, let's head straight into this video. And yeah, I'm um, going show you the first steps on how to do everything. So, first, um, you're going to want to get your hose. Have everything there. Um... With the hose, you want to make, uh, if it's like city water, you want to make sure you're putting bacteria in there, like good bacteria from the store, the chlorinator, everything, so you don't, like, because there's hard chemicals in the water. So when you have your hose plugged in, um, you're going to want to do what I'm exactly going to, uh, you're going to want to plug in your hose to, um, like, the, the thing that you turn around, and then you're going to want to do this. So, since, um... My pond is indoors. You're going to want to bring it inside. And then this little hole right here. You're going to want to slit that in there. And what that's going to do is that's basically going to support it. You're going to want to. Sorry. You're going to want to just slide, slide that in there. And then that's basically how it's going to look. So it's all. It's all um even. Water, your thing's not going to go like all around like that. And this is why I'm filling it up because the pond is really like, there's literally no water in here. And you don't want it like this. So yeah, we're going to go turn on the hose and we're going to get this baby filling up. So now that that's filling up, got all the water. Um, This is probably going to take a couple minutes. Um, you do not want to leave your pond sitting, so you're going to want to sit next to your pond and everything because you don't want to leave it sitting because you never know when uh, the pond could overflow, so you don't want that to happen. Um, just sit next to your pond, but I'm going to get this bacteria, which I'm going to show you guys, where you can put inside the pond, and everything will be fine because our water is city water, and that's not good because it has heavy metals and everything. So I'm going to bring back the bacteria thing, and I'm going to tell you a little bit about it. So so, I got a chair, and we're, I'm going to be telling you about this product. Sorry, it's not on live focus. I'm so stupid. I should have put this on live focus, so it could be way better looking. But, yeah. So, what this is, is cleaning bacteria. And what it, it says on here, cleans gravel, removes sludge, and removes ammonia. So, with this water comes fish poop and all that, and that causes ammonia. So, that's what you want to clean your, or change your pond. Uh, change the water and everything um and it says cleans mo clean monthly so you're gonna want to clean your aquarium and it's healthy water and this what this what this is is um what this is is cleaning bacteria and it's tetra cleaning bacteria is an inactive blood of beneficial microorganisms sorry you can't even see it that will keep your aquarium healthy and biological balance Aquariums rely on beneficial bacteria to f to filter pollutants like ammonia, reduce organic waste, bacteria colonies fluctuate and re can reduce routine maintenance. Tetra clean bacteria is a mixture of multiple strains and replish and supercharge the cleaning peril, whatever the whatever. So this is basically cleaning bacteria. It's a whole bunch of bacteria and it's good bacteria for your pond because when you when you start up anything you have to have good bacteria and in order like to start up a new tank you need to have good bacteria in order to put fish so this is basically what you put inside anything to have good bacteria so we're going to be putting some of this inside the pond i'm going to be filling up my fish tanks um 
we're gonna be um yeah basically adding water to everything so today's video is just gonna be on the pond um i won't really do a video on the fish tank because you know how that goes it's an easy process just people may not know about the pond and the pond is more like harder to do you know what i'm saying but yeah the water's a little bit higher now and look at the fish like they grow a lot or unless it's just me but the fish have grown a lot and um that's what i want fish to grow the the catfish is over there everything is doing good and the directions use monthly add two teaspoons for every 10 gallons for aquarium water should be added after tank cleaning filter cartridge replacement and when adding new fish no cap can be used in my lab. so this is basically a bacteria so after i'm done adding the water to this pond you're going to be wanting to add this and yeah that's basically how easy it is um and if you want, you can get, uh, what is it? I have it right here, but this one is empty. It's basically water conditioner. And water conditioner is going to clean the water. So, yeah. We got the Jack Dempsey there. The water's still going. And we got, what else? Catfish all the way over there. And all the fish are hiding because the water's, like, moving. Oh. Alligator guards right there. Beautiful fish. One of my biggest fish too. And look, he's going near the court the current because that's what they like. They like the current water. Um, and that's what you always want. You want moving water. So yeah. I'm gonna let this pond fill up a little more. And um I'm gonna pick up the camera once um this is done filling and once we're gonna be ending the video. So it's gonna be in the matter of one click. And the pond is all filled up. Now we don't have to hear no. Nothing. The pond is filled up to a good amount of water. A little bit of cold because it's from outside water. But the pond will literally be warm by the morning. So this is basically a whole guide how to fill your pond, how to do everything to it. Um, remember to use that product or any product that does with bacteria and chlorinating because you need beneficial bacteria for it. So yeah. Um... Hope you've subscribed to this channel. I really appreciate all the support. Um, put on your post notifications so you get notified when I post videos like this. And you never know when I'm going to do a giveaway. And remember to like this video. Um, and yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Remember I stream on twitch.tv slash itaqua713. Um, on Twitch at, every day at 9. So yeah. Remember to go check me out there. And 9 p.m. Um, so yeah, hopefully you guys have a good day. Stay safe out there. And peace out from JJ Fishkeeping. And stay safe. Peace.